More changes could be coming to the bypass lanes on 195 over the Washington Bridge. 12 News sat down with RIDOT Director Peter Alvidi yesterday, who went more in depth on the topic, providing other updates on the bridge. Kristen Brunell is live in studio with those details. Kristen. Kim Patrick, those third lanes in both directions over the bridge opened last month in hopes to mitigate significant traffic backups. But Alvidi says traffic still seems to be more of a problem heading eastbound, specifically near the merges from 95 to 195. According to Alvidi, Brightout has tried modeling different geometries to try to help with the issue and may also reconfigure the merge from the India Street ramp onto 195 East. Alvidi says crashes and breakdowns are causing a majority of the traffic delays lately. Meanwhile, long term projects projects relating to the demolition and reconstruction of the westbound side of the bridge are on track. On the reconstruction of the new bridge, we're uh, doing that simultaneously. Those RFPs also went out last month. We expect during the next several weeks to begin to get the proposals from the companies that will be competing for that. Um, we're very much looking forward to that and um, we'll have that awarded also by uh, the mid late July. As for work happening on the bridge right now, Alvidi tells us reflectors are being installed for better visibility and bigger and more permanent signs are being installed as well in the next few weeks. Reporting live in studio, Kristen Burnell, 12 News.